Solving equations with the unknown on both sides. One way to think about the process of solving equations is to consider an equation as a balance scale, where the two sides of the balance must be kept level. To keep the scale balanced, we must do the same thing on both sides of the scale. Example 1. Equations with a variable on one side. Let's look at the equation x plus 6 equals 10, where x is the mass of a toy mouse in grams. We can represent this equation as follows. A scale with a mouse and 6 grams on the left, and this is balanced by the 10 grams on the right. To get the mouse on its own, we need to take these three mass pieces on the left away. But to keep the scale in balance, we must take away three mass pieces on the right hand side also. We now have x add 6 take away 6, which equals 10 take away 6. This simplifies to x equals 4. The mass of the toy mouse is 4 grams. Example 2. Equations with the variable on both sides. Let's look at the equation 4c add 2 equals 2c add 22, where c is the mass of one cat in kilograms. We can represent this equation as follows. A scale with four cats and two kilograms on the left and this is balanced by the 2 cats and 22 kilograms on the right. We first need to get the cats on only one side of the balance. We take the 2 cats on the right hand side off. To keep the scale balanced, we must take 2 cats off from the left hand side. This gives us 4c take away 2c add 2, which equals 2c take away 2c, add 22. We can now see that we have 2c plus 2 equals 22. Our next step is to take the two 1 kilogram mass pieces off on the left hand side of the scale. To keep the scale balanced, we must take two 1 kilogram mass pieces off the right hand side of the balance. We now have 2c equals 20. To find the mass of one cat, we need to divide by 2. So the mass of one cat is 10 kilograms. Example 3. Solve the equation 5x plus 7 equals 25 minus x. We need to get the x's on one side of the equal sign. If we look at the right hand side of the equation, we see that an x has been subtracted. To cancel this out, we need to add an x. But what we do to one side of the equation, we must do to the other side. We need to add an x on the left. We can now simplify this equation to 6x add 7, which equals 25. We now need to get rid of the plus 7 on the left, so we take away 7. We must take away 7 on the right. This simplifies to 6x equals 18. To get x on its own, we divide the left side by 6 and we divide the right hand side by 6. Our answer is x equals 3. For practice questions on solving equations with the unknown on both sides, visit us at www.11plusgenie.com.